Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a Sephora BIB sale haul and also I went and got some other makeup stuff from different stores so I'm going to show you that at the end. But I'm going to start off with these Sephora items first. So I know I haven't been posting much on YouTube. I have just been taking a few months off from like social media in general. Um, mainly YouTube. I just haven't been wanting to film and haven't been in the best mood so that's why I don't want to, to film but I wanted to film this video today. I've been really excited. I've been collecting some of this stuff for a few months now um, but the Sephora VIB stuff I just got in the mail when um, the sale ends on the 15th which is today so I just wanted to film this video and show you guys what I got and then add in the other stuff if you guys are interested so if you want to see then just keep watching all right so this is actually my first order it came today my second order came two days ago which is weird because it, I ordered it like recently but whatever I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got so first I got the Isle of Paradise Sunny Serum instant face drops so this is a new product that just came out from this brand I like how like bulky the packaging is it's cute so I just got this to try out I love my bronzy drops but I wanted to try a different brand so I got that um I also did get 20% off because I used my friend's discount so uh, next I'm going to show you guys uh, another instant face drops. This is the Iconic London Instant Sunshine Bronzing Drops in Universal. So uh, I saw a couple people using these. Um, this pen device, it looks really cool. So I just got it because I wanted to try it out and I just like how you click it and it looks like a needle kind of, not really, but yeah, so I got this um, to try it out. Um, also, I haven't been makeup shopping in a long time, so that's why, like, recently with my birthday and stuff, I just saved my money for the sales, so that's why I got some more. Look at these. Um, another facial drops. I got the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Niacinamide Hue Drops in the Sun Glow. So it looks like this. I actually have never tried the original. Um, this is what this looks like. I've never tried the original, so I'm excited to try the bronzing version of it. Um, I just wanted to try, again, different ones, so that's why I picked up that one. Next, I got the Milk Makeup Cooling Jelly Tint in Burst. It's like a hot pink color. Um, I ordered this stuff, like, at midnight because I was so excited and also scared that some of the stuff would go, like, sold out. So I'm glad I did because in the morning when I woke up, this was out of stock like all the shades were this was the only shade they had when um at midnight which i'm really happy that i got it but it looks like a little jelly let's watch it Ooh, that is very pigmented and very cooling so it's like a hot pink what mocha sorry my dog is looking at herself in the mirror and crying next i got a couple shades of the soft pinch luminous powder blush this is the custom color that selena's um created and it's her favorite it's in cheer sorry just got pink all over it all right so i'm gonna show you guys the shade cheer um the packaging is the same as her other packaging this is her cream blush for reference it's a little bit bigger um this one's in nearly mauve I barely use these though, so I like, um, I wanted to try the powder ones. So I got this one. It's really pretty in the shade Cheer. I'm going to swatch it for you. And I'm really excited because I was afraid that some of these would come cracked or anything, um, but it did not. So I was really happy about that. So that is the shade Cheer right here. See, that's the jelly to it kind of seems. Um, your hand, but yeah, right there is cheer and i also got the shade happy i basically got the ones that i thought i would wear the most um but there are six but i got this one in happy it's a hot pink and that's what happy looks like it's a really pretty hot pink color the next one i got is the shade hope which was my pinky and that is hope well happy I would say is a hot cool tone pink and hope has a little bit more peach undertones 
The last one I got is the shade Truth. So this is the shade Truth. Oh, that's really pretty. It's like a rosy burgundy color. So that is Truth. So those are the four that I picked up. I didn't get Joy or um, Love because I have both of those in different formulas. So that's the reasoning why I didn't get all of them. I got two samples of the Polypeptide Future Cream from You to the People. So that is everything from the first order. So next I'm going to show you a blush that I picked up that a lot of people have been raving about. This is the House Labs by the Lady Gaga Color Fuse Blush and I picked the shade Hibiscus Haze. This one looked like a really pretty neutral color that I could wear every day. I did want to get the hot pink one, the dragon fruit one, but I didn't and I got the more subtle neutral one. Um, looks like this. I did wear it the other day and it was very smooth. I'm gonna swatch it right here. And that is still the jelly stain even after I washed my hands again, but I picked up that. I really wanna try more shades, but I'm just gonna stick to one for now. So I picked up the Say Dew Blush Liquid Cheek Flush in the shade Baby. I tried to pick different shades um, so that way I didn't have like duplicates of each shade in different formulas and different brands so I just picked this one up in the hot pink since I didn't get the dragon um, blush from House Labs. I picked up the cream one in first day um, in the shade baby. A lot of people love this one so I wanted to try it out. It's very pretty. That is the shade Baby right there. It's a hot pink that's dewy, like the name, but I'm really excited to play with this. I also picked up the Sol de Janeiro 62, the, just the classic one. This is the big bottle. Um, I want to collect these, so I bought all of them, spoiler alert, but <laughs> I got this one. Um, just it's a happy perfume version so that's why I wasn't gonna get this one but this is the most recent one I got because I was like I just needed to get it to fill the collection of the body sprays so I did take advantage of the 20% off thank you to Ashley and I did get most of them so this is that one and I also got this blush by Huda Beauty Glowish I picked up three shades they are going discontinued so they were on sale for $12 but I got them for $9.80 I believe so under $10 for a Huda Beauty blush um, and it just says it's just screaming me because it says glowish and I love like glowy products right now so I got the color Caring Coral um, this is one of the lighter shades it looks like this is the packaging I was thinking why did I get discontinued like products but I actually really that's when I try them honestly is when they do like go on sale at TJ Maxx or like discounted stores so I was excited to get it for under ten dollars so that is the Karen Coral from Huda Beauty I just love the glow it gives the sheen it's very natural um, and then I did also get very juicy and this is what it looks like it kind of looks like a baked product with squirrels but once you swatch it, it kind of just goes away, but Ooh, it's pretty. That is the shade Berry Juicy right there. It is a deeper berry color that's mauve berries. I don't know how to describe it, but yeah, I got that shade. And then the last one I picked up is Charming Cherry. I love red right now and cherries. So. Um, swatch it with a clean finger. This is what the shade looks like. I swirled it. Okay, so they are different. So I'm glad I got this one. This is like a cherry, yeah, a bright cherry, hot pink, red shade. Um, definitely the brightest out of the three. So I'm glad I got all three of them because they are different. So. There are a couple other shades they have, but I just settled for three. So I got three basically for the price of one. So that's a really good deal, especially with the additional 20% off for the sale. So I'm really happy and I hope other people got those as well. So yeah.
The samples I picked are a little cologne perfumes. This is the Armani Code um, perfume. And then I got the Prada Ocean. So I picked up those two for the free samples for that order. And then I did get this for my birthday, which was February 10th, which is a while back. But I never hauled it or have opened it because I wanted to haul it so bad first. Um, so this is the Sol de Janeiro 59. And I'm going to go ahead and open this. I already know what the classic one smells like, so I'm not going to spray it. But I'm going to spray it to the lid. Ooh, that smells really good. I love the color of this bottle. So I got that for my birthday with a $10 off that Sephora gave me for... Um, I think it was like 500 points that you can get $10 off, so I just applied it towards this. And then I got my free birthday gift, which was the Kosas um, Beauty Insider Little Airbrow and Wet Lip Oil little set. So I got that for my little free birthday gift. So that is what I got. This was from a while ago, like I said. I've been collecting this stuff, so. And next, I got the Summer Friday Stream Lip Oil in the shade Soft Moth. And I didn't get a discount on this, which I wish I waited, um, but I used it when I, I just purchased it because I was afraid it was going to go out of stock. And I think some of the shades are, I'm not sure right now, but I just went ahead and got it um, when it was my birthday because I was going to spoil myself and try something new that just came out. But um, I still haven't swatched it or anything, so I'm excited. Whoop! That just got on my shirt. <laughs> it's okay. So that is the shade. I'm trying to wear more lip product because I'm just going to put some water. So that is the shade. It's really pretty. Very, very balm-like. Um, yeah, I'm excited to carry this around my purse. I want to start carrying lip products on my purse and just trying to remember to reapply. Even if I'm not wearing that much makeup, I still want to try and wear these on its own. So yeah, so I got that and then the last thing that I got in a separate order, um, this one I got 20% off. Justin got a random 20% off like in March sometime and I was like, what the heck? So we just logged into his account because he apparently had one that he made when he surprised me one year for our for my birthday like way back in the day but yeah anyways they sent him a 20% off so I just used it on this one this is the Sol de Janeiro 40 and again I have not smelt this one yet um but yeah so it's 20% off so I went ahead and just got it because I've been wanting to slowly collect them so I didn't get them all at once this has been since my birthday which was in February so I just got it here and there trying to justify all why I bought all of them but okay. that one smells super super good I'm really happy I got this one so that is what I got and then I got three little freebies I got the Giorgio Armani eye tint silk in rose ashes it was a little freebie and then I also got all these samples within all those orders so good little recipe peace out so yeah that's all the free samples I got within all those orders somehow so um that is everything from Sephora now I'm gonna jump into what I got from Ulta so for Ulta's birthday gift they had the Olaplex three-piece set so that is what I chose for my birthday gift from Ulta um, so I got a repurchase of the ordinary glycolic acid this is my all-time favorite Tony solution I use it every single night so I just uh, repurchased because I am almost halfway done with mine so that's when I like to repurchase a backup so I got that and then my birthday was $10 off of 50 so um, I used it towards this. And then I also wanted to try the e.l.f. Camo blush in Pinky Promise. This is a hot pink blush. I'll go ahead and open it. This video is going to be so long, so I apologize. But I was really excited and in a makeup mood, so that's why I got all this makeup. That is the shade Pinky Promise right there. 
really pretty. And then I also got this. It was 50% off a certain day. So this is the Benefit Gimme Brow. And I got the shade 3 Neutral Light Brown. And this is just a repurchase because I had one. My first ever one ran out. So I picked up a repurchase. So I got that. And then also a different day. Every day was 50% off certain items. I got the Sniff Sweet Ash Fine Fragrance. It looks like this. I haven't even opened it yet. I wanted to sniff it on camera for you guys. So this was, like I said, 50% off. And I wanted to try it. It's a brand that I've never tried. Oh, that is nice. Oh, the cap is like magnetic. I like that. It's kind of like woodsy and vanilla, but also like clean, if that makes sense. So I really like this and I'm glad I took a win and purchased it. I really like the cute little box it came in. So these went viral, so I went ahead and picked them up. They were only a $6 fee, so that's why I picked up four shades. These are really dark lip tints. They go on and then you wait 10 minutes and then you peel them off and then they come out with a beautiful wash of a tint. So I got the shade Pink. Clover, Hazel, and then I also got Mauve. I've been seeing this a lot on Instagram, so I wanted to try it. It was 25% off, so it's the Leroy Prochet CC Balm B5. I purchased two of them because I don't think they normally go on sale, so um, they're originally $18.99 or something like that, and they're on sale for $14 and some change, so that's why I picked up two, and then I used the $3.50 off coupon, so um, they came out even cheaper, so I picked up two. I've been using it every single night on my T-zone, um, mainly where I have enlarged pores, trying to diminish them, so I picked up two of these ones in the bathroom already in my skincare regimen rotation, so I got that. So this is the last one of the Sol de Janeiro. This one is 71. Um, this I believe I got on sale for $10 off. So around my birthday at Ulta. And then I also got this free gift of the Bum Bum um, the oil, which I've never tried. So that was a little freebie that came with this order. The last couple things are free gifts with purchases. So first I got this little Anastasia gift bag, and then it came with the crystal lip gloss just a clear lip gloss and then this one is a mascara so I got this little free gift set um with purchase two so this is the beyond lash i really like this mascara i have a few samples that i'm working on right now um but i actually am wearing it right now on underneath a l'oreal mascara this is one of my favorites i always get samples of those so i love that um this is the olaplex number three i got the benefit 24 hour brow setter little mini and then a shiseido um, power concentrate so that is all the free things that i got from ulta I'll show you what i got i got a lot of goodies from the cosmetic company store outlet i do have one close by um so i picked up some goodies and i'm really excited to share with you everything was six for sixty dollars so everything is like ten dollars a piece but basically i went twice i got some stuff on my first round with my mom and then she was still kind and bought me that stuff and then the second time i went with my old coworker Haley and i bought six items so i'm gonna show you guys this is the Too faced born this way ethereal light aluminizing smoothing concealer i am cracker i actually used it the other day and it was really pretty um and i just wanted a very light concealer for under the eyes just to brighten and this has a luminosity to it which i really like so i'm happy i got this the main reason why i went i wanted to find the Too faced eyeshadow palettes they're ten dollars a piece that's crazy because on Ulta and Sephora, some of these are still full price for over $30 each. So this is the Born This Way Sunset Strip Tease palette. And me and my mom both got one each. So this is what it looks like. And then this was the last one. This is the Better Than Chocolate palette. And yeah, this one retails for $54. The original sticker still on there. Like that's crazy. $54 for eyeshadow palette. And this is what this one looks like. So I'm really excited to play around with the eyeshadows. This one I got was the Sweet Peach palette. I'm glad I never purchased these at TJ Maxx because I think that at TJ Maxx like $25 each. Um, so I'm glad I waited and I got these three for $10 a piece. That is literally insane. 
so I'm excited to play with some makeup. I used to be really into makeup um, before, but I stopped collecting it. But I'm gonna get back into it. Like today, I did some makeup. I got a Clinique blush. This is the Sculptery Cheek Contour Palette in the shade Defining Roses. They had two different ones. This one's originally $43, it says, but I don't think it was that. This is what this looks like really pretty so I'm just gonna swirl my finger in there and show you what it looks like it's a very natural pink shade next I got the Too Faced chocolate soul natural chocolate um, bronzer and golden cocoa I saw this in another video and I wanted to try it out and I just love how cute the packaging is but this is the natural chocolate Next, I got another bronzer from MAC. This is the Skin Fix Sunstruck Radiant Bronzer. I got the shade Radiant Light Rosy. They only had this one and then a deeper shade. So this is the one that I could potentially work with. Um, it did look like cool tone in the pan even though it says rosy. So I'm going to swatch it for you because I couldn't swatch this one in the store. Oh, that's going to be perfect. So that's a really pretty bronze. It has a sheen to it. Very pretty. So that is the MAC bronzer. Next, I did get a MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Blush in the shade New Romance. This was the last one and it looked really pretty. I actually don't have this. I actually collect them, but I have most of them. This is in the shade New Romance. It's a very pretty hot pink, bright pink shade. I think I'm going to love that and it has a good sheen to it. So I'm happy I picked up that one. Lastly, I got two face products. So I got the Too Faced Born This Way Healthy Glow SPF 30 Moisturizing Skin Tint in the shade Almond. It was really hard to pick. They had like a lot of shades. Um, you just shake it up because it separates. But I did use it one day and it was really, really pretty. This one I got is the MAC Studio Radiance Face and Body Radiant Sheer Foundation. I've been always wanting to try this. This one's in the shade N0. They didn't have much to choose from. But I actually really like this shade because it is a little bit lighter. And um, for the fall and winter months, this is going to be perfect. And I can wear it right now, transitioning as well into the spring before I get tan. To the summer so i got that again the same kind of bottle so that those are each ten dollars a piece so that is everything that i picked up from here they also gave me a sample of the clinic moisture surge and this dr jar serum so that is everything for this collective makeup haul i hope you guys enjoyed if you have a sephora vib sale video please let me know down below i've been binge watching them seeing what everybody else been recommending and i still have today so i keep like going on the website and i'm like no and then i keep watching another video it's a bad cycle but um anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up comment down below video request below and let me know if you have one of these videos filmed because i would love to watch it um and hopefully you guys got some goodies and yeah thank you for watching and i'll talk to you guys soon bye